Hello and welcome back to Mentoria Moments. Today I'm just going to be making one of my party favorites, pinwheel sandwiches. Today I'm going to be using garden spinach herb wraps, cream cheese, ranch seasoning, pepper jack cheese, I have smoked turkey breast and honey ham, wax paper, and the plastic food wrap. Let's get started. Okay, so first I'm just gonna lay my wax paper down and I'm just using this to work on top of. I'm sorry. So I'm gonna just lay the wax paper down. And I'm gonna go ahead and open up my wrap. You wanna go ahead and get your cream cheese and mix it with your ranch seasoning and any green onions or whatever else you would like to add in there and mix it around, soften it up. I'm gonna be using one at a time because I don't wanna, you know, use too many and don't need it all and have to throw stuff away. So, okay, now that I got it mixed the way I want, you wanna make sure that you get the cream cheese mixture all over the wrap. Now there's no particular way to do this. You just wanna get it spread all around really good. And you wanna get every piece of the wrap. Nobody wants to bite into just a flour tortilla. So after you got your cream cheese, all added you want to go in with i'm using pepper jack cheese if you haven't noticed by now that i love pepper jack cheese <laughs> i'm here for it so i'm going to add um two slices of pepper jack cheese i'm not a cheese person but pepper jack is probably the only one you're going to get me to eat and then I'm gonna make this one honey ham, so I'm gonna go in with my ham. Just like that. And then I'm just gonna turn this around and we're gonna wrap it. When you wrap it, you wanna make sure that you do it tight. You don't wanna have any space in between your rolls. So we're just gonna take it, fold it tightly, pull it towards you as you roll it, towards you, wrap it, wrap it, wrap it. And there's one. Sit it to the side. Then you wanna get your plastic wrap. and you want to wrap it. It's always better to let these sit overnight. If you're not able to do so, at least give yourself a two hour window of refrigeration. And there you have it. Once I'm done, I will show you what it looked like after it sat in the refrigerator overnight. Okay, so I am back after you have left your wrap sit in the refrigerator for at least 24 hours. You wanna just go ahead and open it up. and you're just gonna slice it. And there you have it. Pinwheel sandwiches. Pray for me and I'll pray for you. And until next time, 
going about your business and have a blessed day.